Hello and welcome back to Package Rebellion. I am your host, Barry Lumbersquatch. Uh, this week we have the newest release by Hate Eternal Upon Desolate Sands out now via Season of Mist Records. Uh, this was released on October 26th. Um, October 26th seemed to have been a very popular date for releases. As if you watched the last episode, the Languish album Unworthy came out on October 26th. Hate Eternal, um, Cognitive was released October 26th. Uh, that'll be on an upcoming show. I think the band Cold released their album on October 26th as well. And they are going to be featured on an upcoming show as well. I think I said as well twice in too close to succession or however you want to say that. So it sounded weird. These are things, these are my little hangups. Um, so Hate Eternal, yes. Uh, band started by Eric Rutan, who is from New Jersey, just like I am. New Jersey boy. Um, Eric Rutan is a producer. He's been in several bands. Um, Hate Eternal was started in 97 after... Uh, I, I won't say after he left Morbid Angel, but during his time with Morbid Angel, you know, he did, um, easily my favorite Morbid Angel album is Domination that came out in 96 and Hate Eternal started in 97. And I mean, Domination was, again, my favorite Morbid Angel album and like Where Does Slime Live, uh, Dawn of the Angry, easily my two favorite songs on that album um, but he's also uh, besides being uh, probably one of the best guitarists in death metal and the lead singer for well at one time for uh, Morbid Angel and of course now of Hate Eternal uh, he's a producer who owns a recording studio uh, his recording studio is located in Florida and he's produced bands like uh, Belphegor, Cannibal Corpse, Madball, Agnostic Front and just to name a few, and he also produced the latest Morbid Angel album, Kingdom's Disdain, that came out in 2017. So that's pretty interesting. The dude's pretty, really busy. Uh, he's got a huge, um, I want to say, repertoire. Um, I don't know what the hell. There's a list. A uh, list. What's a good name? I, I don't know, but he's the dude. Eric Rutan is the dude. Uh, this is their seventh studio album. Again, it's it's uh, out on Season of Mist. Um, there, let's see, the variants that I know of, that, uh, again, my research, I try to go through, like, the European releases and everything. Um, the exclusive LP uh, was gatefold on blue vinyl, four-page insert that was limited to 150 copies. I thought that was European only. Apparently, I was wrong, because I saw it in their Bandcamp store which is why I didn't get that one. Uh, they have the gold vinyl and four page insert limited to 300 copies. Uh, red vinyl that's limited to 350 copies, again with a four page insert and a black vinyl. Well, you already know I didn't get the blue one, so that doesn't leave too many options. I'm not gonna get the black one. So which one is this? Got my knife. Let's do this. Uh, I don't have anything witty to say about uh, Pain Eternal or Morbid Angel. Blah, 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 blah. Usually I have like some sort of anecdote or I try to tie it in somehow. Or I don't. Like last week I talked about... I shouldn't even say last week, last show. Uh, I talked about uh, my Red Sox winning the World Series, which is super important to me. Da, da, da. Season of Mist always packaging well. I need a new blade. This thing stinks. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. Gold vinyl, strictly limited to 300 copies worldwide. Hate Eternal. New album delivers death metal at the highest level. Upon Desolate Sands remains true to its Floridian death metal roots. We all know Florida is huge for death metal bands and like the epicenter of U.S. death metal, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, okay, so here we go. It's a gatefold. Really awesome artwork in memory of Sid Buckland and Arlene Myers. It's got a nice textured feel to it. Again, it's produced by Eric Rutan. I mean, why wouldn't he? So there you go. 
Try to keep this straight. Woo! Really awesome artwork. Whoa! Little four page booklet that suddenly fell out. So let's just leave that like that for now. There we go. We got a picture of the band. Lyrics. Really nice. Really nice. Well put together. And on the back, band members, um, producers, all, all you know, the credits. Booking. He Eternal uses and endorses. They would like to thank. Ah, that's awesome. That's a cool booklet. I enjoy it. I like the booklets. I like the lyrics. That's what people, like these kids growing up, man, they don't get it. Like, you can't get artwork and lyrics and all this stuff on digital. It just doesn't work. It doesn't. Plus, when Apple deletes your account and you lose all your shit, you have nothing left. There you go. Nice gold. It's actually got a nice swirl in it. I don't know. Let's see if I can move my, my hand, but here's a nice swirl and it's not really a solid cold. There. That picks it up there. You can see it up here. Can you see it over there on Instagram? So not necessarily a solid gold, but I like that. The blue was really nice. I saw the blue and it really popped well. So what am I going to do? Where am I going to put that? There you go. The brand new one. From Hate Eternal Upon Desolate Sands, out now via Season of Miss Records. Uh, you can find all the links and all the information in the YouTube show notes. Um, you want to shoot me an email, questions, comments, suggestions to Package Rebellion 333 at gmail.com. Uh, social media links are always in the show notes. I'm on Instagram, I'm on Twitter, mostly on Instagram because I like pictures. I'm just very visual. I can't like reading, is beyond me. I can't do it. Uh, what else? I don't know what's on the next show. Cognitive, maybe? Um, possibly. I think I'm going to do cognitive or cold. Could be cold. Uh, but thanks to everybody who subscribed. We're always picking up a couple new subscribers here and there, which is awesome. Um, hopefully, you like what you see. I love feedback, negative. And as long as it's constructive criticism, of course. Uh, what else? You know, maybe click like, share the video if you could. That'd be awesome. And. Uh, Listen, thanks for everything. Thank you for being you. Take care, and I will catch you next time.